Hey, what's happening, my friends? Welcome back to the channel. This is going to be a fantasy fight video. Habib Nurmagomedov versus Kamaru, the Nigerian nightmare, Usman. Now, I know what you're going to say. No, these guys would never fight each other. They have like a brotherly love thing and respect going on. But it's still fun to talk about these fantasy fights. So let's dive into it. Starting with Habib Nurmagomedov. Habib is 32 years old. 5 foot 10, 70 inch reach, mixed martial arts record, 29 and 0, perfect record, just stellar. He is a multi-time world sambo champ, black belt in judo, one of the most dominant fighters we have ever seen in mixed martial arts. Definitely, in my opinion, one of the GOATs, physically very strong, relentless, extreme will to win, is wrestling and grappling, some of the best we have ever seen in the sport. Insane pressure. You know what Habib is going to do, but you simply can't stop it. Moving on to Kamara Usman. Usman is 33, 6 feet tall, 76 inch reach. His MMA record is 19 wins, 1 loss. Super impressive record as well. Kamara has a heavy wrestling background, NCAA Division 2. He has a black belt in BJJ. Basically just as dominant as Habib. As well as Habib overwhelming wrestling when he chooses to go that route super physically strong just a specimen great cardio great conditioning this is the scary part constantly improving now his stand-up is lethal usman is very mentally strong as well so the matchup how could this fight possibly play out let's just say optimum weight for either competitor if they were to compete, it probably would be at 170 or close to that. Both of these guys are two amazing competitors and very similar in many ways. To me, Kamal is a bigger, scarier, stronger, and more dangerous on the feet version of Habib. Here's a tidbit of information. Habib has fought at 170 pounds. He is a freak himself, but I just can't see him out-muscling Usman. Do I think Habib is the better overall grappler skill-wise? Yes, I do. But Usman is damn skilled enough in wrestling, then with a strength advantage, that more than balances things out. So to me, the wrestling and grappling will be negated. Who has the edge on the feet standing? Usman. Usman all day long. So if this turns into a striking affair, I don't see that ending well for Habib at all. I can see Habib trying to work his way in, with the same pressure as with every other fight, Usman keeping him at bay with that beautiful jab, the threat of the right hand. If Habib does close the distance, I don't see him taking Usman down. Habib is a beast, but I just can't see him muscling Usman around, unless he's gassed out, which is probably unlikely. I think Habib will get shrugged off, forced to stand, and simply picked apart. KO TKO for Usman is not out of the question, if the fight stays on the feet, which it most likely would. Final pick for me, Kamaru the Nigerian Nightmare Usman. But boy would this be an amazing fight. We'll never see it, never gonna happen. And I'll tell you what, Habib is one of the only fighters out there that stands any chance of beating Kamaru Usman. Of course, near his weight class. Anyway guys, let me know in the comment section who do you think would win this fight and why? Whether you think Habib would win or Usman, I would love to read your thoughts. Always fun to talk about fights, have these fun debates. Thanks for watching the segment. If you enjoyed it and this is your first time at the channel, consider hitting that sub button. Like and share helps the channel grow, which it has been. Thank you guys. And until the next segment, you all take care.